Welcome. I'm so glad you decided to join us for the creative visualization component of the Aspire Coaching. Briefly, I'm going to go over the benefits of creative visualization and then we're going to slip into a guided visualization. So let's just start by remembering that our subconscious does not know the difference between a real or imagined experience. And that's why this exercise is just so powerful. Every time you engage in this exercise, your subconscious doesn't know that what you're viewing on the motion picture screen of your mind isn't real. And because you go back and you review it repeatedly before you know it, your subconscious becomes so comfortable with it, you start to attract opportunities and ideas until you find Find yourself at the point where you actually bring or call whatever you've been focusing on into your actual experience. It's incredibly powerful. So the first thing that you have to be aware of in this exercise is that it's really important for you to choose something that's really clear and concise that you want to achieve, a goal that you can focus on. It may be something you aspire to. It could be an incredible trip or a journey that you want to take with someone that's very important to you or with your family. It might be a sponsorship that you want to create within the company or sponsors that you want to create within the company and seeing all the benefits of helping those people and of the financial component of sponsoring and you see yourself in that wealth and abundance. Perhaps it's seeing uh, your dream of something physically you want to manifest in your body. Maybe it's changing a dress size and seeing yourself zip into a dress that you've never been able to fit before and it's loose and it just hangs in all the right places and looks fabulous. Or maybe you want to create that perfect dwelling or home and you see yourself standing in that home looking out at a gorgeous view that it offers. Whatever it is, the sky's the limit, but you're going to pick something and you're going to have absolute clarity around it. And then once you've chosen that, I'm going to walk you through a simple, brief relaxation process so we can get into a really relaxed, deep state and I'll count you into that. And then with music accompanying us, I'm going to guide you through this creative visualization, having you reflect on who's there with you in this experience as you've created it. And we're gonna go through time frames of weeks and months and right to a final year of achieving this actual goal. And what's really important as we go through this exercise is be as clear and specific as possible and focus on this as much as you possibly can and bring it as much positive energy because a thought plus an emotion equals manifestation. And you can play around in this for as long as you want or for as little as you want. Just be really creative with your process and know that not everybody's going to see a clear picture. Sometimes it'll just be a felt experience or a kinesthetic experience. Some of us will see in HD and others won't. But just be open to holding it in your mind's eye on the motion picture screen of your mind. So let's start now, please. So get into a relaxed state. Find a comfortable seated position. You might even want to lie down for this. The point is to be very comfortable. Letting your body totally relax in this moment. Finding our breath, letting it go. Melting. Bringing in awareness that the print that your body is making, whether the seat you're in or whatever you're lying on, just being aware of how much of an imprint you are making. And we're just gonna start to relax from our toes all the way up to the crown of our head. Starting with our feet, we're gonna let go of any tension. We're gonna let them fall open if they'd like to. Relaxing your calves and your knees, the backs of your knees, letting go of any tension. 
allowing your legs to roll out if that's what they want to do. Let go of any tension in your thighs, front and back. And letting our breath meet us all the way down in our pelvic area and in our hips. This is where we hold a lot of old fear. We're just going to let that go right now. Bringing a loose quality into our abdomen and into our lower back and our sacrum, our sacred sacroiliac. With every breath, we're getting more and more relaxed. We move up into our ribcage area and the housing for our heart and our lungs. And with every breath, we're just melting away, finding ourselves more calm and more peaceful as we sit or lie here. Letting go of our shoulder girdle and our upper arms and our elbows. Letting everything relax down our forearms, into our hands. Every breath is just allowing us to calm down our nervous system and find out peacefulness. Allowing us to feel open Going up into our occipital ridge, all the way around our skull, into our facial muscles. We're gonna release any tension in our eyelids. We're gonna allow our tongue to fall from the roof of our mouth into the cradle of our jaw. And now we're feeling more and more relaxed. We're gonna start our countdown. Sinking deeper and deeper into a more relaxed state. As I count, you're just going to become more and more relaxed on every level, in every way. 10, letting go of everything. Nine, we're relaxing now, letting all the tension and the day melt away. Eight, Seven, becoming more and more relaxed. You're tuning into my voice and letting yourself completely let go of any and all tension. Six, with every breath, you become more settled. Five, four, deeper and deeper into a more relaxed state. Three, completely relaxed now. Two, and one, you are totally relaxed. Your body is calm, it's at peace and ready to start your guided visualization. Right now I want you to think about your life. I want you to relax and imagine your current situation. And I want you to think about your family and I want you to see you and your family interacting on the motion picture screen of your mind thinking about them and what's important about them to you. See yourself with your friends and why they're important to you. See yourself interacting with them. Thinking about your career now. I want you to see yourself working See yourself doing what you're really, really good at. See the parts of your career that you love and the parts that motivate you and inspire you to do better. And when we see all of these things in our mind's eye, 
in our current situation, in our current life, how does it make you feel? Just take a moment and imagine. Now we're gonna to start to think about your goal, what it is you really wanna create and accomplish in the next year or two in your life. Whatever this experience or situation or idea or object that you want to materialize, this goal, it could be a relationship goal, it could be educational, career related, perhaps it's personal, but I want you to select one aspect of your life and I want you to think about why this goal is so very important to you and how it's connected to your heart. How will achieving this goal add incredible value to your life and to your family's life and everybody else around you? Because you'll be so inspired by this goal, your inspiration will lead by example and will start to inspire everyone around you. Think about this goal and see this goal in your mind's eye. Have clarity, absolutely crystal clear on what it is you want to achieve. Now I want you to imagine yourself going forward into the future. One, two, three weeks. As you go forward into the future, it is now one month into the future and you have started to embark on the road to success. What choices have you made? What actions have you begun to take? How does it feel to be connected to a goal and to be well on your way down the road to success? Continue going forward. It's now six months in the future and you are that much closer to this goal that's tied to your heart. You are starting to feel the benefits of all your efforts. You're owning your day. You're consistent. You feel closer to your goal than you've ever felt before. How does that feel? What emotions do you feel as you move closer toward your goal? Just imagine it. You're so much closer to that which you really desire. People are starting to see your success and they're commenting on it. What are they saying? How are they cheering you on? As you continue to go forward, it's now one year into the future. And you have fully accomplished your goal. You arrived there earlier than you even conceived was possible. You've achieved success. You see yourself. What do you look like? What are you doing? Now that you've arrived at this goal, who are you with? Who's sharing this moment with you? See yourself at the end of the movie. What are people saying to you? What are they saying to other people about you? And what are you saying to them?
How do you talk to yourself now that you've achieved this goal? How does this success feel? Relish it. Feel pride in it. Can you actually feel a physical sensation in your body now that you've arrived there? What is the emotion? Name it. Do you feel open? Do you feel strength? Do you feel grounded and satisfied? Are you proud of yourself? Now we're gonna look back on your success and we're gonna look back on the process of achieving this success and the road that you took. Let's reflect on all of the conscious effort you applied to be able to make this goal happen. And let's look at all the effort and the consistency. Let's look at how you reached your goal step by step. What were the little things you did day by day, the incremental commitments you made to arrive here, to achieve the success? What did you do at work to fuel this goal? What did you do in your relationships? And what did you do inwardly to achieve the success? Take a moment to think of all the steps you took to accomplish your goal. Congratulations. See yourself celebrating this success. It feels so good. And you can play around here for as long as you want. And when you're ready, go back to your breath and feel the relaxation in your body. Feel the confidence, feel the strength and feel the smile on your face with the pride. And when you're ready, you can stretch in your body, encourage a yawn, move around wherever your body needs to move and slowly start to bring movement back into your fingers and toes. And when you're ready, you can blink your eyes open and feel the gratification and satisfaction that you took the effort and made the step to start building your dream consciously on the motion picture screen of your mind, building the program, the habitual program in your biocomputer to find success, to realize your own dream and to make your goals come true. Good work. Come back to this as often as you like. 